Hi, welcome to the Fruitscapes blog. I'm going to talk about avocados in the home landscape. And uh, this is a Simmons avocado tree. This, you can see the small fruit that's been set. The tree is loaded with fruit. And some of the things you should be paying attention to are your fertilizer, applying fertilizers, and also irrigating regularly. And even though we're having a severe drought this year, and if we take a look at the canal, this, this home is on a canal, you can see how low that canal is, and we are under water use restrictions. So you need to follow the South Florida Water Management District uh, regulations and rules for when you can irrigate. But when you have an opportunity to irrigate, you want to be sure you're irrigating your avocado tree because of how much fruit it has right now. Also, as I mentioned, paying attention to the fertilizer uh, because you want this fruit to size up. You don't want the tree to uh, become nutrient deficient. Um, and pay attention to any insect or disease problems that might arise. Although these avocados in the home landscape generally don't have a problem or a lot of problems with insects or diseases. What about thinning? Thinning. Uh, thinning the fruit. Actually, uh, there's really no need to thin this fruit. This tree has much more fruit on it than it's possibly going to bring to harvest. Uh, it will begin dropping a little bit of the fruit. It's been dropping a little bit of the fruit every day. And you're going to see that continue for quite a while. And that's because the tree has way more fruit than it can possibly mature uh, to a harvestable stage. So don't worry about it. if you see a little bit of fruit dropping here and there. That's not an indication that it's not getting enough water. It's not an indication that you're not fertilizing it well. It's just an indication that there's, there's so much fruit on the tree it can't hold it all.